Ibrahim alayhi salam, he is mentioned a lot in the Quran. And this is for a number of reasons. Firstly, because he is from the greatest of prophets. Secondly, the incidents that took place in his life, they were incidents regarding how he stood by the Tawheed of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and how he rebuked shirk. From the time of being a child when he broke all of the idols until you know, throughout his whole life. And thirdly, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, when he's addressing the people in the Quran, who was he addressing primarily? Firstly, it was the Quraysh. And Ibrahim salam was used because the Quraysh, not only did they acknowledge Ibrahim, they were proud and they used to attribute themselves to Ibrahim and say, we are from the descendants of Ibrahim salam. So when Allah would mention Ibrahim, he's using like a common ground, something that they already agree upon. And the story of Ibrahim is mentioned in different places in the 